Princess Eugenie has been put in a royal no-man's land as the tenth in line to the throne, a royal expert has claimed. Princess Eugenie is one of the most popular members of the royal family with her down-to-earth approach to the public and personal Instagram account. Eugenie is tenth in line to the throne and the granddaughter of Queen Elizabeth II. However, the princess is finding herself in a royal no-man's land an expert has now claimed. Together with her older sister Princess Beatrice, both have received the princess titles by the queen. But in a staggering twist, neither receive any royal allowance. Royal expert Richard Fitzwilliam said, It is absolutely true that both sisters are in a royal no-man's land, getting attention particularly when they holiday, but not being working royals and having very little public appeal. Princess Eugenie is technically not a working royal, despite undertaking some royal engagements such as accompanying her grandmother to the Easter Day church service in Windsor, and to the Royal Windsor Horse Show in Royal Ascot. So because the princess usually does not carry out any public duties, unlike her cousins Prince William and Prince Harry, she does not receive allowance from the privy purse. The privy purse is the British sovereign's private income mostly from the Duchy of Lancaster and was amounted to about £20.1 million in net income for the year to March 31, 2018. While the income is private, Queen Elizabeth II uses the larger part of it to meet official expenses incurred by other members of the British royal family. Instead, Princess Eugenie works as an associate director at art gallery Hauser and Wirth, a position she has upheld since 2015. Mr. Fitzwilliams believes things should stay the way they are, and there is no reason Eugenie should receive the allowance. He said, there is no reason Eugenie should receive an allowance, she is reportedly doing well at the art gallery Hauser and Wirth and is happily married. She has become a patron of charity, Water which aims to bring fresh water to the disadvantaged, Project Zero which helps restore and protect the oceans and Tate Young patrons which is excellent. And the royal limbo Eugenie is finding herself in maybe beneficiary to her. In an interview with Harper's Bazaar Eugenie said she loved her job, adding, I've loved art since I was very little. I knew I definitely wouldn't be a painter, but I knew this was the industry for me. I love being able to share my passion for art with people. In addition, as the tenth in line to the throne, Eugenie did not require the Queen's permission to marry. The Queen was in attendance when Eugenie walked down the aisle and said I do to Jack Brooks Bank at St. George's Chapel in Windsor on October 12, 2018.